Welcome to the ITU studio in Geneva, where we're conducting a series of interviews ahead of WTPF21, which is the sixth World Telecommunication ICT Policy Forum, which is going to be held here in Geneva between the 16th and 18th of December 2021. I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today uh, by Mr. Fabio Bigi, who is uh, the chair of the Informal Experts Group on WTPF 2021. Mr. Bigi, welcome to the ITU studio. Thanks for the invitation. Ready to respond to your question. First of all, I wanted to ask you, can you tell us a little bit about the WTPF preparatory process? How does it work and what are the key issues on the agenda? So as you are very likely are aware, the WTPF uh, 21 has been uh, agreed by the plenipotentiary conference in uh, 18 uh, with uh, resolution number 2 and uh, the theme for the uh, policy forum has been uh, agreed by the council in the, with decision 611 uh, and in 19 since then uh, the uh, ec uh, there was calling for experts. I was uh, a nominated chairman and there was a call for experts from various uh, uh, members and we have quite a, a good team, uh, I have to say, of experts together to draft uh, the uh, Secretary General report and the text of the opinion to be presented at the policy forum. Uh, at present, we, uh, 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 we are holding our last meeting and uh, for the time being, I have finalized more or less the report of the General Secretary to be presented at the forum and uh, the possible five draft opinion. How can new and emerging technologies like AI, 5G and the Internet of Things facilitate sustainable development and what actions can governments take to drive this? As I say, say that there are five different opinions uh, all deal with this aspect uh, and particularly the aspect of the role of uh, establishing rule and uh, made mode of utilization of uh, dif different technology in order to avoid uh, discrepancy, to avoid uh, uh, possible problems uh, and uh, things like that. So all that is coming together to formalize uh, and the role of new technologies essentially in this uh, world, uh, changing world and this improving uh, facility necessary for our normal life. And this is particular for developing country where to have to go come to same level of connectivity and the same level of uh, mutual understanding. Now, this year, Italy holds the presidency of the G20. In your role as informal expert group chair, what are some of the commonalities in the priorities and the discussions? Uh, the, uh, I have to say the final press release for my Ministry uh, of Economic Development has uh, stated the accent on the digital economy and uh, new technology and the impact on the human being. So there are the team uh, uh, treated uh, were more or less very close to those of the uh, uh, policy forum will treat. And we, I hope that will assist, help also in making the final conclusion. I found the final press re release very useful. And finally, what is your one key message to those taking part of WTPF 21? What makes this WTPF special and why should people attend? The people should attend because uh, they set the future of uh, telecommunication ICT and the uh, scenario for future world. And uh, past experience, recent experience with the pandemic situation has indicated us how important are telecommunication ICT in this present world. The world will continue to work thanks to them. A improvement in this uh, uh, facility is essential to keep on mo go going. What I, the message to the policy forum participant, first you should attend IDAIR level to make a decision uh, globally valid. Secondly, make the normal practice of ITU to have consensus, to reach agreement, to reach solution because the world wants to have solutions, not problems. 
Fabio Biggi, as always, a pleasure to have you in the studio with us, and we look forward to catching up with you again soon and, and seeing you at WTPF 21 in December. Sure, I will be present and uh, support the uh, designated chair from the Excellency Minister from Ghana. Thank you very much indeed. Thank you.